welcome to another edition of Taping Twigs with Savvy. Now listen, I put it out there today on Twitter. I put it out on Insta. I put it out on somewhere else too. I don't know where, but it's out there. And you guys voted, yes. What tape job should I do this evening? And you chose the Vancouver Canucks super rookie, Elias Pettersson. You couldn't ask for a better guy right now. He is on absolute fire. It's so exciting for Vancouver Canucks fans. No one knew this kid was take off. You gotta be honest. And he is a special talent that will be a force in this league for a long time. So we're gonna do his tape job tonight on the stick that he uses, a Bauer X1 Lite. I have one in the house still. So we're gonna show you right on his stick. Okay, a couple things to touch on before we move on to the tape job, which I'm really excited to get to. And I know you guys are, especially you adults. I always say kids, but I think the adults are loving this show too. I like it too. Listen, so. We have new hats coming out, two new lids coming out. They're gonna be on the market soon. Beautiful uh, mesh back lids, um, fit any style of head, big or small. So that's a good news. There's one coming out, I think it's blue with a little bit of a red logo, which is gonna be a really sharp hat. And I think the other one's maybe black and white, but a very nice look. Um, and keep it tight hoodies, Project 91, keep it tight hoodies. They're gray though, they're gorgeous, just like the black ones. If you didn't get a chance to get a black one, they sold out in a bang, get a gray one. They're so comfy, winners come in, sitting by that fire with the wife, or the wife has it on too. Both you can wear it, they're unisex, they're beautiful. You can find those at project91.ca, project91.ca. That's where you look for those kids. Get your, get your parents there, get them under the tree. We got lots, we got lots to go around and it's all for a great cause, concussion research. A great cause. Now, one more thing. Remember, these tape jobs that we do, we did Nathan McKinnon's last week. You know, we got Brad Marchand stick in here. We got a couple different things. The guys that I don't know, I know I have like, what do you say, babe? We got like 65 player sticks now and their tape jobs come right on them. There's Marchand's right on the stick. So I kind of have an idea what they're doing. On the other hand, the guys we don't have, like I don't have a McKinnon stick, but from what, from, what, from what, sorry, my eye test tells me, and I'm pretty sharp when it comes to it, this is how McKinnon does his stick. So stuff like that. So remember, half the tape jobs I kind of think, you know, are from my own eyes, what I see, and the other 65 sticks that we have here in the house are the actual tape jobs of the players. Okay, so let's, let's move on here to Elias Pettersson, the super rookie number 40 for, yes, your Vancouver Canucks. Now listen, what he likes to do with his Howie's tape. Okay, I got the Howie's hoodie on tonight too. It's a little fit and nice, okay? So what he likes to do, another guy, he likes to rip that tape, okay? Because this is the normal size of the new skinny. When I was a kid, you know, it was another half inch smaller than that. Now they don't make that size. These are the two sizes everybody makes. So we're gonna go with this. This is what Elias does. So he's gonna go on and he's gonna make his knob, okay? He uses black on the top and on the blade, which is different, kids. It is very different. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep it tight, obviously, look at that strike, look at that. Just stroking around this here. Looks really nice and tight here. We got it down, okay? And pick a number. Most guys pick a number. I don't know what Elias is, his number, but we're gonna say he's there. It doesn't look like a huge, huge knob at the top, okay? So then he's gonna break it off. Now, I like to break it off like that. I'm not sure if Elias does. Now, why I break it off like that, folks, is when you start your next roll down, you don't have to go over the knob, which leaves a nice gap. So now all he has to do, okay. Sorry, Howie. I'm just gonna waste that piece because Howie hooks us up. So we're able to get rid of those. So what he does now, instead of going over the knob, now you start in the back below the knob. See that, kids and adults? You come around here and Elias likes to do that, keeping it tight, okay. And he's gonna come down. Now he likes, a rather lengthy knob like myself, which is nice because he's a, I think he's a playmaker first. I know he has 10 goals, but you're going to see in his career, I think he's going to be more of a, a disher than a sniper, but he has sniffed lately, that's for sure. So let's come down. He has a decently lengthy knob, okay? So there, we're going to break it off there, go around, keeping it tight, remember? Break it off in the back. Give that a nice pull. Look at how sharp that is. That is just a thing of beauty, okay? Have a, keep an eye on that, babe, for me for a second because I need something here that I'm looking for and I don't see it at the moment, which is frustrating. Oh, I do have it, I do have it. Of course I have it, Howie's clear plastic. Okay, so what he does too, now remember we talked about this in shows past. He is a centerman 
And a lot of guys have issues with this. So what he does, he takes the clear plastic and he does a loop around the bottom here. Nice, keeping it tight. Go around once there and break it in the back. Keep it in the back so it makes it look pretty. Now, Elias is a centerman. Remember what we talked about? Coming down the ice, you know, and you, you, you know, not necessarily not coming down. So you get in for a space up. You're digging down. Okay, you got your hand, you got your lower hand here, and you slide up. See how that, that doesn't interfere with the tape, doesn't roll it up, keeps it tight, okay? So that's how Elias is able to keep a beautiful knob, okay? So there's his knob. Now, let's move into his blade. Very interesting here, not very interesting, sorry, just a pretty normal tape job, but in black again, he likes to do it all black, okay? And I believe he uses thin on the bottom from what I can see in his pictures and when I've seen him on TV. So he comes here, now he leaves a good two inches from that heel, you see that adults and kids at home? Two inches from the heel, okay? Do that nice, keep it tight and go around here, okay? We're gonna go around, keeping it tight obviously and just down the blade we go. Now this kid, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if he stays healthy. We know he had a quick injury early on. If he hits the 80 point, 85 point plateau this year, maybe even more. I'm just taking the low side actually, just to make myself sound a little studlier, but I think he could break those numbers actually. Maybe 90, let's go with 90. I think maybe 90 points for the kid. Okay. Come right to the end, remember, come right off the end, folks. Keeping it nice, Elias likes to keep his blades nice. He takes care of his sticks, I can tell when a guy loves his sticks. When you take care of your sticks, they'll take care of you. So remember, this can make or, take, make or break a tape job. So we're gonna go to the toe. Look at this. Howie, we need scissors, bud. These are getting a little stale, okay? Look at Sydney Alley, you got a little pitchfork there, but look at, come back over that and you save it. No problem, flavor saver right there. Boom, oh, that is tight, honey. Can you get a zoom in on that? I know you're a great camera work. Whew. Look at that, okay? So there you go, folks, there you have it. Elias Pedersen, beautiful. You're gonna be able to check that out and use it. You know, and like I said, black at both ends, you know what? The old thing about black on the knob would ruin your gloves, but I don't think that Howie's tape's so pure now. You don't even need it. But anyways, I want you to know that, remember, check out project91.ca, check out my Instagram, check out my Twitter at msavvy91. But most importantly, people, most importantly, be good to your sticks and they'll be good to you.